everybody what is up welcome back to another borderlands 3 video and today we are taking a look at one of the old mayhem six kings that is gonna be none other than the chaos and smg so me this puppy right here right here now everybody who uh everybody who played this game back when mayhem 10 like first came out Y'all know how sought after uh, the Chaosin was, right? It was like one of the best SMGs in the game at the time. Hands down, bar none. You couldn't, you could not uh, disagree. This gun was super, super good. Obviously, uh, right before the Guardian Takedown launch, they did kind of nerf it. They nerfed some of the, uh, the accuracy on it, uh, which does hurt it a little bit. But, uh, yeah, for those of y'all who don't know how this gun works or anything, basically, it's a doll SMG that shoots torque sickies that then explode, which is very, very solid. Uh, you can get this thing from Captain Tron, but you have to be on Mayhem 6 or above, so just keep that in mind. Uh, moving on to our setup, we are using a Radiation Old God. We're using uh, the Fire Mind Sweeper. You love to see it. And then we are using the Beautiful Pearl with Mag Size and Fire Rate. Along with that, we are going to use, be using a CMT. Uh, and then here's a look up at our setup. Our bottomless mag tree, bada bing, bada boom. And then here's our demolition woman tree, bada bing, bada boom. And then here is our shield of retribution tree. Anyways, though, guys, there's nothing really much uh, uh, to go over with our setup and gear wise. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and hop right into the video. <sighs> All right, you guys, so we're over here at the Guardian Takedown now. Uh, with this one being a time two and everything like that, uh, well, yeah, we are probably going to be, we're definitely going to be re reloading a lot with this setup for sure. But, uh, yeah, dude, this is like, honestly, my first time using the KO scent in a very uh, long minute now. Just have not really, uh, I've not really used the KO scent, honestly, since uh, the Guardian Takedown came out. Uh, and then, like, you look at other, like, SMGs these days, you have things like, I don't know, the Flipper and the Bloodstarved Beast. Uh, and this thing kind of just feels like it got left in the dust. Now, that being said, this thing uh, is definitely still feeling like it's uh, competent, bro. Uh, just some from some of the first initial uh, things, bro. I mean, we're, we're, we're kind of melted through the enemies, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I was kind of, I was not expecting that. Oh, we even have some of the Reapers here. That'll be a great test for this thing. Oh, hello? Oh, there you are. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. All right. I love, I love the enemies trying to wedge me into a corner. Sorry, sir, but you uh, you got to go down. You got to you gotta eat the dust. You know what I'm saying? So do you. I can hit you. And I did. So you're done. Bed that up. We're going to drop you. Drop. Looks like we got just a couple enemies over here, and, uh, wow, yeah. Uh, this Chaos Inn is, uh, starting off pretty strong. Uh, doing this much work in the Guardian Takedown is, uh, nothing to scoff at. And, uh, I mean, dude, I know some of that fire and Skagans probably helping it out just a little bit, but, hey, it's all good, dude. We, we got some radiation action. We do got a beautiful Minesweeper as well, so, yeah, that can't, that can't be ignored. But, uh, yeah, guys. Uh, so far, so good. Let's go ahead and head over to the Slaughter Shaft, and I'll see you guys over there. All right, you guys. So now we are over in the uh, Slaughter Shaft. I almost have the Guardian take down again. I ain't on a cap. But, uh, yeah, we're over here in the uh, Slaughter Shaft now. And, yeah, dude. We're just, we're just going to put this thing to work, see what it can do. Uh, so far, I gotta be honest, man, the Chaos has really actually been pretty impressive. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I was expecting this thing to be kind of, uh, a bit of a tool. And, uh, in a bad way when I say that, like, uh, I expected us to, like, be kind of, like, tickling the enemies. You know? Not, I'm not, I'm not really, uh, expecting, like, expecting us to have been, like, uh, massacring these enemies like we are. Uh, which is pretty, pretty nice, uh, for sure. So... Uh, well, I guess we'll do like one more wave and then we'll head over to the Malwan takedown, but uh, yeah. So, 
Uh, I'm pretty sure most of you guys know by, uh, know by now, but like we are going to get uh, the new skill trees and uh, some new DLC on the 10th of November. Uh, you know, I plan on using that day for Beyond Light uh, for D2. Uh, so I don't really know how that's going to play out. Uh, we're going to have to play that one by ear. But uh, I was really, really bummed out when, they, when I saw that they were releasing on the same exact day as Beyond Light. Because, man, I don't know how I'm going to grind two looter shooters all, like, like crazy all in the same day. Because, uh, I don't know, dude. We're going to have to, we'll, we'll, we'll find a way, bro. Where there's a will, there's a way. But I don't know. I don't appreciate that. I don't appreciate that, Gearbox. Come on, you guys. Uh, side note, though. Uh, our Chaosin is completely wrecking face, which is awesome. Uh, our Minesweeper is downing us a little bit, but that's all right. Uh, whenever you have things like the Chaosin and the uh, Minesweeper bat, good things generally happen, and, and uh, that definitely just follow the enemies, which is pretty good, you know what I'm saying? I mean, dude, we're, we're, yeah, we're striking face here. Anyways, guys, we're going to go ahead and head over to the Malawan Takedown, and I'll see you over there. Okay, fellas. Now we're here. Malawan Takedown time. Chaosin is killing everything, bro. Radiation on armor, it don't matter. Fire on armor, it don't matter. Fire the Skagden is broken. Kaosin is still super strong. Way stronger than I thought it would be in this video. I'm not gonna lie, dude. Uh, I'm pretty pleased with what we're seeing so far from this puppy, which is great, which is great, because who doesn't love the Kaosin, man? Uh, people that used this thing back then uh, probably probably still love, like, uh, have a little bit of love for this gun, man, because like, this gun was just so good for like, Especially from when Mayhem 10 first came out. And like y'all understand, when Mayhem 10 first came out, there was like there weren't too too many viable weapons inside of Mayhem 10 like we have now. It was mostly just the, the new guns, the cartel weapons and the Mayhem 6, uh the Mayhem 6 on, uh, and up legendaries like the Monarch and Reflux and Backburner, Plague Bear, stuff like that. That it was back when like only those guns were like really, really good and the Chaos obviously was really good. But, uh, yeah, dude, it's just pretty nice to see this gun still slaying out here, even after all this time, even after it's nerfs. Uh, nerfs? After it's nerf. Uh, but, yeah, dude, it's, this thing is definitely, like, really cracked out right now. Are we going to one, one? Wow. Okay. All right. All right, Chaosin. I see you, pal. You're, you're cracked out. You're cracked out. All right, you guys, we are here at the bridge. We do love the bridge. Uh, bridge is always pretty good for uh, showcasing how good uh, some weapons can be. And uh, yeah, dude, we're just gonna we're just gonna be in here, bro. We're gonna shred face. We're gonna wreck everything up. And uh, yeah, we're gonna have a good time. And it's gonna be awesome. I hope you guys have been enjoying the video recently. You know what I'm saying. Also, guys, hope y'all have been enjoying the content. If y'all have, uh, y'all do like to wa uh, watch Daily Borderlands. Uh, a subscription is greatly appreciated, guys. We are on the road to 5,000 subscribers, trying to hit that by the end of the year. Uh, so yeah, if you do like Daily Borderlands 3, a subscription is greatly appreciated. We're getting really, really close uh, to our goal too, which is pretty, pretty awesome. Uh, thank you guys so much. Uh, but yeah, dude, really don't know how we're gonna. Uh, go for uh go about november 10th bro uh for like the past three months i've been planning uh that day to specifically be for destiny and i was really really just hoping that gearbox would release uh their f the fifth skill trees and uh or not the fifth skill tree the fifth dlc and the four skill trees uh on just any other day except for that one and i would just make it work but uh, they didn't they didn't so i don't know how i'm gonna play that day out dude that's uh, I don't know, bro. I don't know. We're gonna we're just gonna have to play that one by ear, bro. But honestly, yo, Chaosin, look at this thing, bro. This thing is still top tier, bro. Uh, uh, this thing was not this good. I don't remember this thing being this fucking good, bro. Oh, hello, Luke Ghost. What you got for me? All right, uh, I'm gonna go ahead, cut over to Wotan, and I'll see you guys in just a bit. All right, y'all. We are over here now at Wotan, the Wotan Smoketon Smackdown of the Century, baby. And uh, yeah, dude, we're gonna fucking just we're gonna sit this dude down, man. We got our radiation and our fire SMG. We're gonna we're just gonna brute force our way through Wotan's anything and everything. And it's gonna be great. It's gonna be delicious. It's gonna be like a king buffet. And uh, who doesn't like a free buffet, bro? All you can eat, 
good quality cuisine, bro. Uh, yeah, serving up a nice fresh plate of, uh, plate of wonton courtesy of the new chef, the Kaosin. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be great. Sorry, Wotan, but you're like low key getting completely bodied right now, bro. Kaosin is just like way too strong for you. I don't, I mean, it, it seems like Wotan just can't handle it. It seems like he's not built for it. Yeah, we're gonna take down the uh, the top path first. Oh, you're Wotan, you're just, you can't handle the truth. You're not built for the task at hand, homeboy. You can handle the power. Radiation, fire, no corrosive needed, homie. Sit down. Dude, the chaos is fucking disgusting. Oh my god, it's still so good. <laughs> wow, guys, hope y'all did enjoy the video. If y'all uh, did, make sure to drop your little that like button and subscribe if y'all are new. Uh, let's take a quick look at the setup, my boys. Chaos in times two consecutives. We do got the radiation, oh god. We do got the uh, plus five find the Skagnet Minesweeper with splash damage, splash uh, damage, radiation, and grenade damage. CMTs with grenade thrown. And then we do have our pro with fire rate and mag size. Coming over here, we got our bombless mag tree. Pretty simple. Get your click, click get your some for the road, get your bombless mags. Uh, and definitely get them scorching RPMs and scrappy. Demolition Woman, just a uh, pretty simple standard tree. Uh, I always spec generally like this. Uh, four to five in the course crash promotion, just so we can get some grizzled up in this puppy. Uh, and then you got the short fuse down there. And then here's our shit retribution tree, boys. Anyways, guys, hope that is going to just about wrap up the video. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you guys did enjoy the video, then make sure to drop your load on that like button and subscribe if you're new on the road to 5,000 subscribers. Trying to that by the end of the year. But uh, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed the video. My name's Cree. And we'll see y'all in the next one. Peace out, everybody.